Hey guys, it's Alex here from alexfergus.com. So today I'm going to do something a little bit different. I'm going to show you what's inside my fridge. All right, so I often get questions, you know, what, what do I eat? And when I'm doing some of these videos, people are like, oh, what's that in the background? You know, what's that supplement or what's that, um, you know, food item? So I thought, you know what, uh, let's just do a candid sort of rundown of what is in my fridge, a typical sort of diet uh, that I'm eating and um, yeah, the brands and, and why I eat particular things. So. Uh, Hopefully this is interesting and adds some insight and value to you guys and, and shows a bit, bit more about my life and my diet. So um, anyway, let's begin. So we'll start, we'll start with the fridge door uh, and we'll start at the top here. So I'm just going to go through these one by one. Um, raw cacao beans, got these from Bali. Uh, put them in smoothies sometimes. Uh, sometimes I just eat them if I don't have chocolate. Uh, we got coconut cream, organic coconut cream. By the way, um, I get this from iHerb. By the way, what I'll do is I'll put links to, if I mention brands or supplements or anything, I'm gonna put a big list at alexfergus.com or in the show notes, so uh, you can you can check that out later on. Or we win. Uh, we got some parmesan cheese. This is New Zealand cheese, so it's grass fed. Uh, it's not organic. I can't find organic parmesan cheese, but we do have organic. Uh, Cheddar cheese, which is really good. It's my favorite cheese. So again, New Zealand grass fed. Uh, we have some rennet from Carl's, Carl's rennet here, which I use for uh, making cheese myself, which I need to get back into. We've got an organic tomato paste. So organic to tomato paste. Uh, we use that for um, pizzas, um, you know, pizza bases and stuff. Uh, Togo saw supplement. Alright, uh, we have astaxanthin here. Uh, we've got some paste, some paste I use for cooking. Uh, organic mustard. Uh, what else we got? We got some uh, organic decaf coffee beans. We have dates. Two packets of dates. I think that one's easy. Uh, empty. Um, it's like my snack food. Uh, we got bilberries that I brought back from Finland. Shredded coconut here and some almond flour. Keep that in the fridge. Uh, we got some chilled spring water. We have some New Zealand organic uh, wine. A little bit of cod liver oil here. Oh, I suppose I should explain some of these things. Actually, you know what? I'm not going to explain them all because the video will be too long. But uh, if you want to know why I'm having some of these things or, you know, where I got particular things, I just, just post a comment in the comments box below and I'll happily answer those questions. So I'm just going to go through and show you what's in here, okay? Rather than explaining everything. So ask the questions later on. Uh, raw milk, A2 raw milk, that I, New Zealand grass-fed milk. Uh, pasta sauce, organic pasta sauce. Rebecca uses that for spaghetti bolognese. That was some ginger, I need to throw that out. That was some homemade um, uh, ketchup that we got from our neighbor. Uh, some organic apple, orange, and mango juice. And some organic store-bought ketchup. So that's the door. I'm probably wasting a lot of electricity here. Let's go through the top shelf. Uh, restore uh, gut health supplement. Get it from iHerb, some lime juice. Got a couple of chutneys up here. Um, and some garlic, some crushed garlic. Some more dates down there. Some sauerkraut. Uh, and then we got a bunch of coffee again. That same brand. We use that uh, Inca Cafe brand. Uh, which is roasted here in New Plymouth. Which is actually, it's actually pretty good coffee. So we got decaf and normal. I don't like the caffeine all the time. Uh, so there's some normal ones as well. So, um, you know, I'll mix between decaf. And actually, I don't drink a lot of coffee altogether. Uh, New Zealand grass-fed butter. New Zealand grass-fed beef dripping, which I use for cooking. We have some New Zealand ghee. Uh, what do we got? More cheese in the back there. What's in here? Oh, here's some fermented uh, sprouted bread that we got from the markets the other day. Rebecca got this. Here are a bunch of uh, tomatoes I just got from our garden this morning. I'm gonna cook them up tonight. Ah, what else? We got some leftover bone broth 
If you don't know what bone broth is or how to make it, I got a pretty comprehensive article on my website. Uh, we got some coconut wraps that I got free from my herb. They're okay, not that good. We got a big bottle of oh, raw milk here. So I use that bottle to fill up raw milk and then put it in these smaller ones. Um, some eggs, these, ignore the labels. These are from my parents' farm, um, just free range eggs. Uh, down here we have some more food from the farmer's market, so spray free cucumbers and carrots. Um, here we have dinner, which is green meadows, grass fed, uh, sirloin. We're gonna leave out for dinner. More carrots from the markets. We got a lot of carrots. We got half a cabbage there, also from the markets. Spray free. They aren't organic, but spray free. Jesus, more carrots, and that zucchini is from our garden. Yeah, I got a lot of carrots. And that's it. That's what's in our fridge. So yeah, hopefully um, gives you a little bit of insight as to what I'm eating, what I'm buying, um, and like I said during the video. Uh, I didn't want to explain why I have everything in there, but uh, if you have questions, you're like, oh, why do I use that instead of this? And you know, why wasn't this organic or whatever? Just um, ask them, just post them. If you're watching this on YouTube, post them in the comment section. If you're watching this at alexfergus.com on my blog, just post them in the discuss comment section below. Um, if you like this, give me a thumbs up, subscribe on YouTube, check out my other Authentic Alex videos where I show more of my life. And uh, be sure to subscribe at alexfix.com because I release a lot of pretty in-depth blog articles on health and fitness and how to look good naked. Um, yeah, I'm going to leave it there, guys. So, signing up. Bye-bye.